schools. For some students, it was their very first time leaving mom and dad to join new peers in a classroom setting. 1011 Chanel Taylor McCarthy followed one kindergartner on his new adventure, spoke with staff about all of the excitement. Chanel Taylor. Yeah, if you can remember your first day of school, it probably went a little like five year old Axel's. You're filled with excitement in the beginning and then it hits you. Mom is not going to be in class with you. Eventually you warm up to the idea and begin what will be a 13 year journey. It is truly something that doesn't get old. The first day of school never gets old. Hand in hand, West Lincoln Elementary's newest and youngest learners march to the start of the school year. Hi. And five-year-old Axel was ready, but still apprehensive about what lay ahead. Once they get in the building, great things happen. Once inside, his mother and older sister helped him journey to his kindergarten classroom. When he found it, he was thrilled to see his name displayed at his new desk, and he was already impressed. Hmm. You pretty much got my name right. But after putting his backpack in his cubby, the reality of kindergarten became all too real for Axel, and he took cover under his desk. With a confidence boost from mom and the sound of other kids joining the class, school didn't seem too bad. They said, yeah, you're a big boy because if you go to kindergarten, it's a big boy. They said, oh, okay, mommy, I go because it's a big boy now, it's no diaper. I excited. Principal of West Lincoln Elementary, Scott Schwartz, says it's normal for students to feel anxious on their first day. He says all that subsides thanks to the support and encouragement from teachers. When your child walks in the classroom, your child is with a great teacher and just trust that they're going to have a great day at school. And when they get in that pattern of learning, everything goes away. Reporting in Lincoln, Chanel Taylor McCarthy, 1011 News.